All right, next we have the keyboard. So we'll take the other end of the keyboard and on the back of the Think Client, there is actually a keyboard picture. Uh, hard to zoom in, but there is a keyboard and network symbol there. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug that in. And then next is your mouse cable. So this is a USB that can go into the available USB port on your Think client. So we're gonna go ahead and plug in right under here, since that one is available. All right, last but not least, we have the, we have the power source for our Think client. We're gonna go ahead and plug that in. Here you'll notice on the one end um, is a yellow uh, port. We're gonna go ahead and locate that on the back here. And you see that the port I'm plugging it into is also yellow, so that will work. All right. And then of course the other side is the power source. Here we go. This is the end of the power, which I will then go ahead and plug into my power source here in the room.